hello guys welcome back to my youtube channel sorry i'm looking like this sorry not sorry because <laughs> i just finished filming a reel for instagram and just give me a minute let me put on my wig and change my outfit and then we'll start with this video i don't know why i like looking at myself in the camera but it's just normal so let me just get into this video just stay tuned if you want to know all the youtubers that inspire me and if you like to just get new people to watch on youtube because there are a lot i try to narrow them down to like 10 or 5 but no i have 30 a whole 30 and if you watch my hand movement you know i just made my nails so and they're looking so nice okay so i'm back now and we can go right into it i'm going to be telling you their names and maybe how i got to get their page or their youtube channel and what i know about them just briefly because they are a lot let me show you i even have it written down here they are like 30 can you see how much they are that like is a lot but i'll be going through them one after the other we're going to be starting these youtubers in no particular order because i love them all and they inspire me to do more i even wish i could be as consistent as some of them are and even as relevant as some of them have been over the years but this is in no particular order so the first on the list is going to be jenny jenkins i actually got to see her page like a whole like a long time ago like this should be like around is it going to be five six years ago or even more than that and i used to watch her youtube videos like on makeup and all that because I really love makeup and that was why I decided to even be a makeup artist to start with so I used to watch a lot of makeup videos and all that that was why I started watching Jenny Jenkins so now the second on the list is Lydia Stanley if you people are familiar with a lot of Nigerian youtubers you definitely know Lydia Stanley and I've followed Lydia Stanley for the longest like even before like was, was she still in school then I can't remember but before she got married and now after she's married and now she's with her husband everything about her i love it and i love how simple she is like she just makes everything she shows on her youtube channel very real and relatable like you can relate to everything she shows on her channel like very very relatable and real that is why i like lydia stanley and i love the fact that she's comfortable in her skin she's comfortable with her body size and everything she's just she's very very confident she's a confident person and simple so that's how i'm going to describe her so you should also do well to go to her page and follow her or on her youtube channel to subscribe moving on to the third person i think i'm already taking up a whole lot of time because i said we have to do this briefly like i'm just going to be giving very brief descriptions on each person but hopefully <laughs> i don't know how i'm going to be able to achieve that because i i might have a lot of things to say about a particular person so moving on to the third person this is going to be mimi j mimi j i've actually followed her youtube channel since when she finished from OU because she actually attended OU and um, now she's married she got married recently then i've watched her transition from when she was in nigeria to her moving to dubai and it has just been a whole lot like i love her growth she has always been consistent and those are people i look up to and they inspire me to even do more going to the fifth person this is going to be alia j alia j just like jenny jenkins like i used to watch her youtube videos because of her makeup she'll give you like tips on how to do things she'll give you like do's and don'ts and all that and i actually followed her like around the same time when i i subscribed to jenny jenkins channel too that was like about six seven years ago like it was a long long time ago even by that time I, I didn't even think of starting up a youtube channel although i knew it was something i was going to do eventually but as at that time how would i even start which one did i even have nothing so i didn't even think of starting when those people were, they were like they were already bosses then by that time like seven years ago eight years ago like that so miss alia j she was very good and now she's actually still good with her makeup things and all moving on to the fifth person because i'm going to be really fast now moving on to the fifth person is going to be only brandy only brandy i got to know her through 
Instagram first. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Through Instagram first. Then I got interested in her personality. Then I saw that she had a YouTube channel. That was why I even thought of following her on YouTube. I like the fact that Oyin Brandy is God fearing and she still does a lot of things that are relatable because she's a young girl. She's a young girl, but she's getting it. She's 23 and she's married. Yeah. So I just love her lifestyle. I love things about her like there's some things that she does that are worthy of emulation so that is why i actually subscribe to her channel and i like follow her and catch up on her videos and all that so the sixth person on the list is going to be pot of flavors pot of flavors i actually got to know her page through my dad he was one who saw it and he sent her video to me like oh just check out this girl's page especially because there was a market i wanted to go to or there was something i wanted to buy as at one time and she made a video about that and she gave a lot of information so that was why i followed her channel and if you follow her channel you get a lot of good information from there you learn a lot of things you see she does a lot of market vlogs and i wonder how she even does that because how would i go to the market and carry camera i'll be so shy i can't even do that going on to the seventh person the seventh person is um Ronkera G. Ronkera G, I have followed her for the longest um from the time when she did her wedding in nigeria even before then but i knew when she came back to nigeria to do her wedding and all of that like i've been following a lot of people's chat like i know people <laughs> so there's nothing you put on your channel that i don't know about like i knew when she got married when she gave it to her two kids and all that but all of a sudden she just went and we didn't see her again until recently i think i even watched her most recent video that was yesterday or was it day before yesterday and then she actually made some shocking revelations or would i say shocking revelation or shocking news and i felt a bit sorry for her but i'm more happy for her right now because she's back on her feet and she's better now eighth person is Sisi Yemi. If you know Nigerian YouTubers, there's no how you wouldn't know Sisi Yemi. Sisi Yemi, I love her because she cooks. Like sometimes I even used to feel like, oh please, can this woman just adopt me so I can even eat a little bit and just add flesh. This woman cooks a lot. She cooks like food that is even pleasing to your eyes like before you eat it you know that yes this food is delicious and i love how she handles her home like she cleans well she takes care of her family like all her children she doesn't default anywhere though i'm not saying i'm only saying this based on what i see i'm not going to say i'm i'm um, standing and saying or defending her or saying things like I trust that she takes care of her family. I'm just saying this based on what I see in her videos. So you know social media is just what I see in her videos. That's what I'm saying out here now. But generally I love Sissy Yemi. In her family they eat. I love the fact that they eat very well. I wish she could just come and adopt me, I swear. Next is Stephanie Mocha. Stephanie Mocha is also a young girl, but she's getting it. Right now, she's even doing, she's studying abroad right now. But I love her confidence. I love that. Would I even use the word carefree? But she 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 takes life as it is. Like she's just a very, very free-spirited person. Like she's she she's the kind of person that gets into a room and just lights it up. She's young, but you wouldn't know because she would even come into a room where there are older people and even engage them in conversations and just generally she is a very smart girl. Then after Step, uh, Stephanie Mook, I'm going to move on to the next person, which is going to be that girl, Dami. Dami, I followed her for a long time, just like Jenny Jenkins and Aliyah J, because of her makeup um, videos that time, and she used to do a lot of. Uh, makeup that had a lot of colors like she embraces color she's a woman of color she's a dark skinned lady but she uses a lot of colors and i just found that intriguing and i love that for her it made her stand out and i just loved watching her videos 
now the 11th is going to be ace family if you know them you know they have this thing and they be like um what's going on everybody like i just love their family i love how things are with them i love that they started this youtube video they gave birth to children and their children right now are into the whole youtube video that they make like their life is just so lovely based on the videos i see it's so nice they have really nice house they have really nice car i love their videos too and i love the fact that they started video um youtube videos a long time ago until now they are still relevant that's one thing i hope to achieve too like starting youtube and still being relevant over a long period of time there's somebody else that also fits into that category but i wouldn't mention her now let me just move on to the next place 12th is tony olawi if you follow tony olawi's video you know she says um um if you are new to my channel you are most definitely welcome <laughs> she'll be like oh my name is tony tony olawi and if this is your first time stopping by you are most definitely welcome if you are a fan of her you will definitely know that she always says that most times and i followed her for a long time she's in ontario canada if i'm correct i know she's in canada but i'm not so sure of ontario but she's in canada and she recently came to nigeria to have her wedding she's a nigerian so she did her wedding recently i love to see young girls that are getting it and that is why i followed tony olawi she also used to do makeup videos too but now i love where she is right now i love her growth i love to see where she has gotten to now so that's why i love tony olawi next person is going to be diara Diera, this is the person I love to think that I look like. Yeah, I think I actually look like Hasha. Mm. <laughs> Don't let me start capping. But that girl, she is the it girl. Like, mm -mm. Diera is the kind of girl like every other girl is trying to be like, yes, she is getting it. But like people that know me and they know I watch YouTube video, a lot of people know that I have been following Diera like since the longest, since she was like, when she was still with ken when her channel was just still dk4l before she split with her boyfriend and all of that but mm, i love their relationship but it's only god that knows best <laughs> for 10th person is this is amina i love her because she um she takes care of her daughter properly she, very well <laughs> was properly she takes care of her daughter very well and i love the bond they have I think she gave it to her daughter when she was much younger so um i don't know but i love the fact that she embraced it if you notice they just brought the light back this is nigeria so expect anything there was actually no light before so that was why i decided to use natural lightning and i love the natural lightning so whatever <laughs> i hope this is cool now okay the 15th person now that means we've gotten to the middle already and i'm so excited because that means i'm not taking much of your time but at the same time i hope you are enjoying this video the 15th person goes to no other person than tomike adeoye if you watch nigerian youtubers there's no way you know no tomike adeoye i love her because she's also a young girl and she's getting it it's like maybe that's why i follow most of these people because i've said young and getting it for like how many times now you know Tomika Adi, she's going to be like, oh, this she will advertise uh, Martina, she influences for a lot of people. Please don't mind me with this monster. I don't know, it's even showing that there's zero sugar, but it's too sweet and I don't even think I can drink it again. So, um, <clears throat> Tomika Adi, like I said, I love that she's young and she's getting it. She has her first child already, second child on the way already. That's even if. The second child is not here already because to make her deal she can award her videos for a living she said she was going to change but who knows but i just love her personality she's a free-spirited person and she just lights up any room that she gets into that's why i love her next is uwani aliu uwani aliu i followed her since 
since like my pre-degree days oh, in school, like since my pre-degree days, I followed Wani Ali because I was like, oh my god, who is this fine girl? Like, uh uh, Wani Ali is a fine girl. I love her sense of style. She dresses so well. She, ah, no, 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 no. She has very impeccable style. I just love her. Like, that's why I followed her. Though there was a time when she had like a break in transmission. She went to office with then she came back again. But everybody needs that break once in a while. Look at me. Sometimes after this video, who even knows if I'll take another two months break? But no, I'm not about to do that. I would actually be consistent. God help me. <laughs> then, forgive me that I'm looking down. But you know, I told you I wrote them down. So let me just. Keep reading through. Thank you. Next is no other person than Vivian Okezie. Oh my God, I love Vivian Okezie. I've been following Lilia, um, Vivian Okezie since she was in Cyprus. Was it Cyprus? Yeah, I think so. When she was still schooling then, and up until recently, I still watch her YouTube videos. Like I love catching up on people that I love. So you people, if you know you love me, so please continue to catch up on my videos. Please, I promise to drop interesting content for you. Please, please, and please. I love Vivian Okeze. She even has a drone. She uses her drone for her videos. If you see, no, 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 the quality of her videos are top notch. Like, mm -mm, this girl doesn't play with her edits. She edits so well. Like, I love Vivian Okeze. She recently got engaged. Mm -mm, we are the online in laws. And it's so, and I know she said she's going to be giving us updates on everything. So I'm trusting her to give us the updates. And I'm going to be following her videos back to back to back to back. Next person on the list is Yechi. I am Yechi. I recently started following her like let's say a year ago. It's even up to a year. I don't know. But since I started following Yechi, no, Yechi, she's getting it. No, she ticks, she ticks all the dots, like she marks all the boxes. She's just no no no. Yechi is good. She actually does well with her edit too on YouTube. Like if you just want to learn from some people. If you know you want to go far in this YouTube, with these people that have been mentioning, you should actually check them out one after the other. There are some classes you will not even have to pay for if you follow some of these people because when you watch their videos in details, if you go back to like their former, former videos, they've actually talked about a whole lot of things. Maybe how you can edit your videos, maybe how you can edit your Instagram pictures, maybe how you can get, they just talk about a whole lot of things things that some people even collect money for like they teach you in a class you can actually learn it just from watching these people's videos and i'll be glad if you do that it's not like they're paying me to do this please watch my videos too thank you 19th person is ihoma is i love this girl so much i don't know why i just love her i love her edits i love how she edits her youtube videos she's just a natural honestly she's a natural like she does all these things effortlessly she's actually friends with mimi j they used to live in dubai before but recently she she has said that's ihoma she moved to the uk for her master's program and like i just love her lifestyle she's a simple and easy going person if you watch her videos it does you see how much she smells and she laughs like She's just, I don't know, I love Hyoma. Like, my Sundays are not even complete most times without watching her videos. Even today, like this, by the time I'm done, by evening, when I just settle, and maybe I'm just snacking on something later in the evening, I must watch her video. If I don't find her video, I'll go and look for Mimi J's video. Or just part of all these people I listed out, I must watch their videos so that my evening is complete. I just love Ihoma Easy. I love her aesthetics. I love her feed on Instagram. I love how she dresses. She, mm, mm, she doesn't miss. Then she also has a business. She sells perfumes. And the perfumes are actually so nice. I know I'm going to cook one pretty soon, honestly. So, number 20. This is no other person than Kamsi Nnamani. Kamsi. 
this girl she's the one who's going to teach you how to be classy how to be posh if you go to her page you'll be like oh you see things like oh what to do in your 20s or what you can do to level up what you can do to this what you can do to that or like maybe outfits you shouldn't wear so that you don't look like a trashy girl or something she doesn't use the word trashy but you understand what i mean like she might just give you tips on outfits to wear just to look classy and stuff she will even give you ideas of like habits to drop in a new year and then she has been recent she has been doing a series recently like living alone because she recently moved into an apartment and she has been showing us like things she has been getting in the apartment and everything she also has a business a furniture business she just started that too but i love to see that for her and where she has gotten to so the next on my list is Olurie Shaw. Olurie Shaw, I love her and I love her family. I just love to catch up on her videos too sometimes. So I love Olurie Shaw too. Then the next, next, next person. This is part of the big leagues in YouTube. Like mm -mm, these are Nigerians that have been getting it like since before we even thought of starting youtube or anything this one they know all the corners they know all the ways they know everything about youtube this is dima ume dima ume a lot of people follow her on instagram she has started youtube a long time ago i look up to her a lot too she inspires me she's consistent she's a catholic is it catholic now anglican who are those people that used to use rosary or something and she doesn't joke with it like she even got one ring like this like a knuckle ring that has the same um, cross sign or something i don't know what they used there but it had that thing on it and it was like gold like mm -mm. she doesn't joke with that and i love that for her she has like this clean girl aesthetics which i love yeah moving on hmm. this one is like the grandma of all of us <laughs> In case you've not even started YouTube, she's going to be like your great grandmother. This is no other person than Jackie. I know Jackie, 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 Jackie. Jackie does um, makeup videos. She's a content creator. She has a YouTube channel, obviously. She has a line for candles now, like scented candles. That's her business. Jackie, I know is clean. Like if you see her videos when she's cleaning her house, you'll be like, what is this? She even arranges her perfumes like in order, like she has like white bottle perfume, she arranges them, blue colored perfumes, pink, red, or oh, ah, uh, uh, ah, God please, oh, God when, <laughs> God when, Jackie, I know it's clean, I love her, and she has been relevant, she's the one I wanted to say before, earlier, when I said that people who have been relevant, like who have been in the game and are still relevant till now, She's part of people I was talking about. Jackie, I know as you mean relevant up until this day and even till tomorrow. Though we don't know what will happen tomorrow, but uh uh she has been relevant. Yeah, so the most annoying thing just happened. From twenty-four to thirty, I read I was done filming and I just checked the videos and I realized that they were in time lapse, so they were just going in a hurry, 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 and now I have to refilm, which is fine. I'll do it for twenty fourth on the list, which I said earlier before is um, Kelechi Ngwemina. Kelechi Ngwemina is a young person. I won't really say she's young; she's not so young. At least she's not Gen Z. <laughs> Kelechi Ngwemina. She's the kind of person I said that if you don't want to pay for tutorials or anything, you can just go to her page. You will learn a whole lot from her. Like, just watch all her past videos, watch all her previous videos. You'll gain a whole lot of things. She will show you how you can, like, make videos even on your Android phone, how to edit, how to do, like, natural backdrop in your house, how to snap your pictures by yourself for Instagram and all of that. You will learn a whole lot from Kelly Chang Gemina's videos like a whole lot so go and subscribe to her page or her channel whichever next is chinyere abang chinyere abang she has three children i love the fact that she's not so young but she's consistent with her youtube she has three children 
she cares for them, cares for her husband, then she does a whole lot of things all together. She she her house is always so clean most times and um I love the fact that she's she's satisfied with whatever space she finds herself and she just makes the space work for her because even there was one time when um she was in a former house and the kitchen was not looking so aesthetically pleasing yet she filmed in that house and it was just a thing to emulate like just start from somewhere like make do with what you have at present and just go with it like just make do with what you have and just move with it i'm just happy that i've not cleaned this makeup if you notice like this my countenance has already dropped because i was done filming and now i have to do it all over again well well the next person is laifa laifa is like our mother in makeup like she does makeup for a living she has a makeup brand merak cosmetics she has this same um, black under eyeliner i use that for this makeup that i did on my face as if you notice she actually has a setting powder also i use that too merak setting powder laifa does a whole lot of videos like from makeup videos to like when she has clients or like bridal clients she shows like a day in her life as a makeup artist she shows her family she shows her sisters she also sells hair like units but her younger sister styles them too so moving on to the next person which is the 27th i would like to take the 27th and 28th together which is amy okoli and then fisayo those two are like gen z's you see especially for amy you know how i style dresses that she just wears skimpy clothes that is how amy dresses too but it fits her style I love the fact that Amy is actually really smart. She's a law student. I think she's in her final year now. She's in, in she's in a uni in Abuja, but I'm not so sure. I don't know if it is uni Abuja or I really don't know. But she's in her final year, law student. She's a smart girl. I see how she reads. I see I see how she studies. She balances everything so well. She balances school well. She val she balances socials so well like she just does it correct she comes correct for her pictures for her videos and everything then for fisayo fisayo is a funny one i love the fact that she doesn't have so many friends like that when she's around people she vibes along with them but she's just in her lane i watch her videos because they're funny i watch her tiktok videos i watch her youtube videos i see her videos on ig too she even tried to replicate this ashake thing one time and it was so nice like she did it well it was so good so those ones are also getting it very well then the 29th is chloe dosh chloe dosh she does like makeup videos and all that and then um of recent i actually haven't watched her videos recently so i don't know if she even posts or does anything of such now but after now i will go ahead to check her again on youtube to know whether she still posts or not and then the last but not the least is shalom black i love how shalom black is so confident in her skin i love how she just embraces her black skin and all i love that she vibes a lot with all these white people and they recognize her now and they invite her for a lot of events whether for makeup events or like maybe the launching of something they just invite her out and it's so good it's nice like i love it a lot so with all those people i've already mentioned you should be able to see people that you would learn a thing or two from but please most importantly like my videos and subscribe to my channel all these people i mentioned you will learn a lot of them if you watch kelechi and webinar's video from top to bottom in fact you can start your youtube channel tomorrow i'm confident of that if you can watch i'm yechi's channel 
you can start your youtube channel tomorrow tomorrow like this if you watch ihoma's like former former videos you will learn a whole lot of things from her page too there are a lot of them that i have listed and you will learn a lot from them then even if it is concerning makeup if you don't even know how to do your makeup like maybe you're a beginner and stuff there are a lot of people i mentioned earlier that you can go back to like their previous 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 videos and you'll be able to learn a thing or two so you should be able to do your makeup by yourself also don't worry i'm going to catch you guys in my next video yeah just showing off my nails bye guys